Amazing how quickly this has become one of the best hockey destinations on the planet. Hi, everybody. We're in Las Vegas, Nevada, where the Golden Knights are ready to shine tonight. Well, we've been waiting for this one all day long, and here we go. Let's do this. The puck is dropped. We're underway. Sets a pass in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. We're still in the early stages of this period. Still looking for our first goal. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Minnesota's won the draw. Through the neutral zone and along the boards, here they come. Tried to get 2 2 with it and loses possession. He is so dangerous when the puck is on his stick in the offensive zone, but he tries one too many moves and he loses the puck. Here's a chance. Here's a shot. And he catches that one with the glove. Stone's a bit of a wild card, guys. He's great at takeaways and getting the play to go in his direction. And that's thanks to his yoink zone ability. It's how he likes to generate his chances. Quick pass to Petrangelo. Takes it and looks ahead. Fires it. Handles that one. Sets it in front. has the game's opening goal near the midway mark of period number one. Cheryl, does that still count as that quick start you were talking about? I don't qualify that as a quick start, James. You know, you got to find ways to generate more offense. Listen, they capitalize on what they got, but they have to continue to find their legs and increase the pace of this game if they want to win it. Can't get a hold of that pass. Good hit to knock the puck loose. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. Here's a short pass to Johansson. Oh, excellent use of the stick. Oh, so much Right on the doorstep. He pounces on the rebound and puts it home. I just love this goal, James, because it's about effort on the puck and recognizing who can get to it first. And he jumps. And when he jumps, he makes his opponent vulnerable. And then he fights for position, gains possession, and then makes a beautiful play. Just love it from start to finish. Minnesota's come up with possession after that neutral zone draw. Slides it across. Shot. And there's the save. And he slides it quickly to Bogosian. No room for that one to get through. Backtracks with the puck, but maintains possession. And he takes the dish. Vegas moves it quickly along the wing. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck now. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. And it's a quick pass to Brodeen. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. so difficult, James. I mean, he stumbles, so he's off balance, and he's still able to corral the puck and get it off with precision to the shooter. That leads to a great scoring chance. Getting a little physical there with that collision. The Golden Knights gain the zone. Tries to feed it over to Korzak. Minnesota's looking to break out. Along the half wall with the puck. Nice pass back. Excellent stick work on the play. Moves it to McNabb. Big save. Rebound control is critical in the game of hockey. Putting it to the corner, and now the offensive player has to hound the puck. 
some solid defensive work in the road end with the poke check. From Dean's got it across the line. Quick feed to Stevenson. Clock ticking down here inside the first period. Turn that one aside. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Official signals for the players to get into position, and we're about ready to drop the puck. Minnesota's going to start off with the puck here in the neutral zone after winning that faceoff. Here's a feed in front, and that's stopped. Well, there's the horn ending period number one, but this one is far from over. Lots more action to go. Second period is just around the corner. During the game, please remember to be alert at all times in our seating area. Even with enhanced safety measures, there are moments when a puck can be propelled into the spectating area with enough force to cause injury. So please stay alert at all times when the game is in play. Seeds teams are on the ice. They're ready to drop the puck here for period number two. You can tell we're in for a good one because almost every fan is in their seats here as we are still tied with the second getting underway. Well, Cheryl, already a third of this one played. What do you make of this one? Minnesota's game plan to start this second period needs to be to hold on to the puck, keep it simple, and not turn the puck over. I mean, their opponent has been jumping hard. They got to be ready for it, but they got to make better decisions with the puck. Good, solid check, and he loses control of it. Moves the puck. Here's a chance in front! And that caroms off a twig in front of the net! And he shuts the door on that! Still plenty of time left in this frame. It's all tied up. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Stone. Tries to get it to Cotter. Here's a shot. Can't connect as it goes off the stick. Feeds the puck over to Boldy. Right up the gut into the offensive end. Quick pass to Erickson Eck. Turn that chance aside. Sends the feed in front. Vegas has the puck. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Centering feed. And that doesn't go as it's off a stick. Slides it on over to Brodine. Here's a short pass to Boldy. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Nearing the midway mark of the period. We got a tie game. Minnesota's won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. The Wild have taken possession along the wall. Vegas gains a hold of possession. Moves it up. Marchessault's got the puck. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Well, he's showing off his skill set, trying to make a silky move around the defender, but he gets denied. The Wild have gained control of the puck along the wall. Puts it on net. Gets a piece of it and will play on. Well, all those tracking exercises when you're young come in handy when you're older, and this is a prime example. Look at him, Bob and Weave, trying to find that puck. He does and makes a save. After that huge hit, he's really laboring to get off the ice. And you know that no player ever wants to stay down, so he's finding a way, mustering up everything he's got in him to find his way to the bench. Vegas with possession in their own zone. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. From the right side, they gain the zone. Centering pass, and he denies that great opportunity there. Howden's got it through the neutral zone. Shot! Goalie with a stop. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. 
Carlson's going to try and shake that one off, James. Man, that was a top hit right through the body, and you feel the effects are almost bone crushing, but he gets back up. Here in the late going to the frame, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. Handles the puck. Drives to the paint. Tremendous stop with the blocker by Fleury. The goaltender's at the last line of defense for a reason. This time, he bails his team out. Centers glide into the dot as a face-off ready to resume play. Fraze has won the face-off. Moves it to Kolasar. Stop! Stop! Go ahead! When you can't see the puck, is make yourself as big as possible. But this one has seeing eyes through traffic and finds the back of the net. The Golden Knights have persevered. They've weathered the storm. And look at this. They now lead here late in the second. Oh, and this should give them a real jolt here, James. And they'll head into the intermission with the lead. And this is really important that they feed off of that energy and they come out in the third final. We played 40 minutes. Final chance for the coaches to push their messages home. And we'll see the third period coming up in just a matter of moments. Carlson's not going to be able to return to the game, James. I mean, that injury that he suffered earlier is going to keep him out. This is a tough loss for their team. No, and you clearly kind of know where you stand from a coaching standpoint now. But that is a serious blow to the lineup here for the rest of the game. Vegas takes possession along the wall. Moves it to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Lots of time left in this period. Vegas is trying to build on that one goal lead. Stevenson's won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. Tough spot to be in. You need momentum and you give it back by going on the PK when you're trailing by one. The Golden Knights will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. Well, they've earned their first power play of the game. A tone setter right here and an opportunity to look at the coverage on the setup. Quick feed to Duhayne. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Erickson X got it against the boards. Oh, what a beautiful glove save! Hills made himself look big on that save and almost made it look easy. That's a high shooting percentage shot because it's coming from a great A scoring area. Well, in this situation, he is going to get the tripping call. I thought he had good position there on his opponent. James fishing for the puck, just used his stick and it got into the skates. Tripping is the call. And it's four against four here with the puck set to drop. On a four on four, you can expect all players on the ice when you're possessing the puck to activate. You have to be able to support the puck carrier. And if you're a defender, you know you're jumping into a lane going north. Vegas gains the zone. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Minnesota's penalty has expired. They now go to work on the man advantage. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Here's a shot. Saving a beauty! That's an incredible save, James. I mean, he's got presence in his crease, and he's also got a great glove hand, and he shows it right there with that save. They'll get set to drop the puck as this power play continues. Minnesota's got it, and they're on the attack. Routine glove stopped by Hill. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Marchessault's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. 
Hill's got it, and the officials blow the play dead. Well, and this is a smart play. He's been dialed in all night and recognizes that he doesn't want his team to make any mistakes. The safe play sometimes is to hold on. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Golden Knights lead it 2-1 in what has been an entertaining game thus far. And the power play comes up empty. Both teams back to even strength. Looking to set up offensively. Puts it on net. Off the club and makes the save. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Oh, and a nice play to free up the puck there. Sends the pass over. Oh, some strong physicality on the play. Play is whistled dead as the puck goes up and over. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period, the Golden Knights are clinging to a 2-1 lead. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Look at this down the right wing, they're on the attack. The Wild have taken possession in their own end. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. Picked up along the boards by Rock. With the wonderful maker by Fleury. Stuffs him again. That's a fantastic sequence of saves there. James, he was so dialed in, he tracked it perfectly. Teams are ready for the draw. The linesman about to drop the puck. The Golden Knights win the faceoff. Here's a shot. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. Well, they have the lead, and now they've taken a penalty. So now they're going to be back on their heels. That power play is going to come out. You know they're going to be smelling and tasting blood, James. The PK unit, they got to be to task. Minnesota's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. A power play then can even the score here, James. It is massively important that they create some kind of momentum in their favor on this one. Puck clears the zone. Taken along the wall by Stevenson. And makes the save. Gaudreau scooped up the puck now here inside his own zone. Takes the feed. Oh, can't finish! Well, he can't finish, but a great opportunity right there. Gets his stick on it as he's crashing the net. Quick pass over to Hartman. The Golden Knights have it now. Puck jumped in, allowing for the blue line to get some fresh legs out there. Gets it over to Johansson. Moves it around along the half wall. And that's blocked in traffic. Clearing attempt. And they get the puck out, and they needed that. Uh, they certainly did. This PK unit has been on fire. They get the clear. That's one. You kill valuable time. That's two. And now three. You can contest the entry. That's a great play all the way around. Slides the puck over. Vegas plays it along the wing. Jostled off the puck. Great defensive effort with the stick. Feeds the puck to Johansson. Moves it quickly over to Hartman. A chance in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. A critical draw here. Minnesota's got the puck inside the offensive zone. Scores! A massive goal here in the third, and we're tied! Yeah, and they're on their toes now, and their opponent are on their heels, and this is the critical time of the game now. Faceoff gets set up, they'll want possession. Man, James, he's the benefactor of a great passing play. I mean, incredible vision to be able to land that puck right on his stick. But then he's got to do something with it, right? He's got to read where the goaltender is, and he's got to hit the back of the net. Minnesota's leveled the playing field with that big-time goal here in the third. And usually at the late stages of a game like this, when it's tied, the victor is the one that goes for it and knows that they have to find a way to execute. If you're too worried about making a mistake, you're going to sit back and you're going to have the game taken to you.
didn't have much time to get it off, but he got some wood on it and buried it. Vegas has been in quite the battle tonight, but look at this. The perseverance is showing through as they've taken a one-goal lead here in period number three. Well, there hasn't been much ice out there, James, and they get the go-ahead goal, and now it's about finding more, finding more deep within to push towards this win and this victory, James. It is not going to be easy. It's going to be a claw in the fight right to the end. And this squad has really put the pressure on now. And they'll end all that pressure as they clear the zone. and loses the puck. Quick shot! Scores! They've tied it up here with a timely goal in the third. Well, with their backs up against the wall, they decide to turn the tides and put on the press, if you will, James, and they get the equalizer. Well, this is a really impressive shot, James. I mean, I'm, I'm looking at this going, man, I don't know if any goaltender would have stopped this. The way he was able to move his feet, corral that puck quickly with that quick release, the snap of the wrist to be able to put it by the tendy. The setters will glide into the dot. Dwas won the draw at center. And that's deflected. Comes up with the stop. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. And they win the defensive zone face-off. And that's knocked away. Now he slides it up to Howden. The Golden Knights gain possession along the wall. Fans want a shot here in the dying seconds of the period. And there's the buzzer bringing regulation time to an end. Still tied up. We've got overtime in moments. Are you a super fan? Here's your chance to prove it. If you have Who's walking away with the W tonight? Overtime should give us an answer. And they're ready to drop the puck. Will we get a winner? Time to find out. It's overtime. Look at this. Here's a pass. Oh, what a save. Hill's last save was outstanding, James. I mean, it was a valuable effort that's what gets it done it's beyond the skill to be able to make a save it is the will and the compete level that energizes everyone around him jostling for the puck and he loses control marshall has made a fantastic play james and he's falling to the ice he's got the puck on his stick and he still has the ability to lower that bottom hand and find a way to redirect the puck to the net i mean that's tenacity that's courage and finding a way to compete and will your way to the net takes it to the net it's amazing to me how he always looks like he's in the right position because he tracks and reads the play so well. And this time he gets in front of the puck that's right in the middle of the ice as the shooter's got a dangerous opportunity. Denies him in close. This shot's coming from the middle of the ice and it has some heat on it, but he's ready and waiting for it. He's to position and he makes the save. Oh, it denies him with the paddle save. As a goaltender, you have to be able to read and anticipate the play. He does it perfectly and is able to negate the shot. See if we can pick up some momentum again here as a face-off is ready to go. They take possession as he locks them up off the face-off. There's the horn. Overtime fails to find us a winner, so we'll take it to a shootout next here on EA Sports. Neither team has given an inch after three periods. Nothing solved after overtime, so here we go. They shoot up. Let's go. And he says, uh-uh on that play. Yeah, on the shootout, he's confident and composed. You don't see him moving around in his crease. Just makes himself as big as possible. Looks really efficient. Shot scores! What a goal! Well, I like that he came in with a little bit of speed on the shootout, James. And he didn't give anything away until the last minute. He has that quick release. He was accurate. He buried it. Recognizing that the goaltender's being aggressive, sells the fake one way, drops the shoulder, goes the other, and puts it in the empty cage. Here's the back half of round number two. We are still tied here in this shootout. Make 
makes a save and let them do it in one. Yeah, the body language, everything about him is telling you that he's confident and composed right now. As the shootout rolls on here, and he stops that attempt. I think he just does a great job of making himself as big as possible and took away all the shooting angles. You can look at his teammates' faces on that bench. That There's the call, and they take it in a shootout.